I will now do a straight razor shave beard trim. I will first apply a pre-oil shave all around the beard area along with the mustache area and the neck area as well. This will help soften up the hair follicles. I will now apply a hot towel to help soften up the hair follicles and open up the pores. I will leave the nostril area exposed to allow the client to breathe. I will leave the towel on anywhere from 45 seconds to a minute. I will now apply shaving cream all around the beard area, underneath, in the neck area, and mustache area as well. I will use the Pacino Signature Razor with a disposable blade. I first start off in this area, always making sure I stretch or pull the skin and use my blade at a 45 degree angle. Always making sure I take small, consistent strokes and getting a very detailed line. I will now outline the back of the beard and shaving with the grain. I will now shave and outline the bottom of the beard, always making sure my blade stays at a 45 degree angle using short, consistent strokes. Notice how I let the blade do all the work. Stretching and pulling the skin is always the key to a close shave. I will continue going from one side of the bottom of the beard to the other. Once done outlining the bottom of the beard, I will finish shaving the rest of the neck area. Still shaving in a downward motion and stretching the skin at the same time. I will now start the other side of the beard by beginning in the temple arch area, working down towards the sideburn and going right into the beard. Again, stretching the skin in smooth, consistent strokes, always using my blade at a 45 degree angle. When creating sharp beard trim lines, it's very important you're very detailed and meticulous with your shave. I will continue doing the other side by shaving the back part of the beard, going with the grain and stretching the skin at the same time. I will now do some touch up work to the bottom of the beard, making sure it is aligned and going straight across from one side to the other. I will now do the mustache area Again, making sure I'm stretching and pulling the skin to give it a smooth, comfortable shave for the client. I will now work 
the inside of the beard area, also known as the goatee area. I will use the corner of my blade in making sure I get the hard to reach areas, always stretching and pulling the skin to give me more room to work with. Only using a portion of my blade, I will continue to shave in those hard to reach areas. I will now do all the same steps that I did on the other side of the goatee section. Making sure I always pull and stretch the skin and let my blade create all my sharp lines. I will now finish doing some touch up work on the beard trim and making sure that both sides are even and that the beard trim is as sharp as possible. And now for your final look, a straight razor shave beard trim.